160 million North Americans live on the edges of the continent, on a thin frontier between land and sea. Miami, Florida. This is one of the most populated coastlines on the continent. Irresistible sunshine, white sands, and warm water year-round. In winter, millions of sun seekers flock to these beaches. But just 150 kilometers south, other swimmers are also gathering. Countless sharks, spinners and black tips, some of the most voracious predators in the sea are beginning their journey north to their birthing grounds. They hitch a ride on an enormous undersea highway, the Gulf Stream. The current surges over 1,500 kilometers up the coast. North of Miami, the sharks are forced into a narrow passage of shallow water, and the highway quickly becomes a bottleneck. Each day, more and more arrive until they number in the hundreds of thousands. What few know is just how close this mass of predators comes to humans. More shark attacks have been recorded in these waters than anywhere else on Earth. Earning the Sunshine State its second nickname, the shark bite capital of the world. But despite the splashing swimmers, attacks are rare, and in Florida, you are 30 times more likely to be hit by lightning than bitten by a shark. But the spinners and blacktips have their own dangers to fear. A 